So one of the first questions I usually get asked when we try to talk to the customers of possibilities of using ISO 100 wireless to cover both process control and uh, safety needs is cybersecurity. And uh, generally it's, it's a very abstract thing to discuss because we say we have 128-bit AES encryption and uh, it's the same as NSA use on their standard uh, application for encryption. And there's always weighing between the flexibility of encryption and how safe it is. But basically, if you say that today's supercomputers can crack a 64-bit key in about a second, you would say that 128-bit encryption might not seem so safe. But for, for every uh, bit you add, you, you add a lot of safety. So the difference between 64 is uh, 1.8 to the times the power of 10, 19 times. And it's 38 times for 128-bit AES encryption. So that means even taking into account Moore's law, we have twice the computer power every two years. That means that with 180-bit uh, encryption, we will get down to one year, 78 years from now. So given our conservative estimate, we would say that it's a relatively safe bet that the problem won't be anyone doing a brute attack to, to crack your system. We are seeing a much higher risk of untrained personnel or not keeping your, your keys uh, protected. So it's down again to having a good cybersecurity strategy in your company. They won't be able to break into your wireless network on the ISA 100. 